what we educate people about is the system and the process and not so much about the law. We don't, we don't teach them uh, about criminal law, the substance of the criminal law. We don't teach them about contract law. What we teach them about is how the system exists, how it operates, and what are the checks and balances that keep it fair and impartial. Many people in the public are forming opinions about the courts and uh, they're forming that either based on drama on TV or high profile cases that are reported in the newspaper only partially, not the whole story, and uh, often on United States or state Supreme Court decisions that are highly politicized. The fact is that every day in every state in the country, hundreds of judges meet with tens of thousands of citizens. Around the country, thousands and thousands of judges are meeting with citizens from around the country and addressing the issues that those people have brought to the court and asked the court to address. So our presentations are very interactive. We don't uh, give a speech. We don't give a lecture. We're not trying to teach law. We're there to help people understand how the system works for the average person who shows up in court. And so we interact, we talk with, we participate with, we even role play. We, um, we have a, a uh, hypothetical slip and fall case and we have some of the people role play as if they are the plaintiff who slipped and fell and some people who uh, are the defendant whose sidewalk wasn't shoveled and some people who are the public at large and we talk to them about what is it, what is it that you expect when you come into court? What is it that you want? It takes a lot of effort. It takes a lot of effort. It takes some very strident uh, commitment from a core group of people. Um, it takes a lot of uh, co cooperation with people. It takes uh, a lot of leadership. So it's, it's a significant effort. In Colorado, we have uh, been operating for five years and we've uh, given more than 350 presentations and we've talked to more than 11,000 people. In some ways, that's a drop in the bucket. In other ways, um, it, it's been a great success. It took a lot of work. For lawyers to be involved in this program, to volunteer in this program, ultimately, we, we lawyers have been given the privilege of advising and representing citizens with regard to the law and the court system. And it is that system that our citizens depend on. Ultimately, we have the responsibility to preserve that system. And so when we go out as lawyers and speak to the public and have a more informed public, part of what we're doing is helping to preserve the rule of law. One of the things, it's very, it's very, um, uh, and rewarding when you hear people talk about what they want and you realize that is what our court does. Our courts listen and they apply the law and they apply, to, they apply it equally with regard to everyone. And when you hear, when we ask the people who are assigned the role of public, who are not involved in the case, do you care about this? And they say, yes, I do. Well, why do you care about it? I care about it because someday I might be in court.